Yo, what's good, YouTube? what's good, YouTube family? It's your boy, Michael Naps. Today's video, man, we got drunk driver brutally crashes headed on into police car. If you guys are new, man, if you guys want to join the Nappy Squad, hit that like button, subscribe. Let's get into the video. In February 2022, an officer was on duty with a dispatcher riding along as a passenger when he responded to a potential hit and run accident in Middleton, Wisconsin. While proceeding through an intersection, he saw a vehicle speeding toward him in the wrong direction. Initially, he believed the vehicle might have been stolen, with the driver attempting to pass other cars. However, it turned out to be driven by 26-year-old Sergio Ramirez, who was driving under the influence. It quickly became evident that Sergio... Now, one thing I do not like in this world is drunk drivers or people that are drinking and driving because that's dangerous and it's just, it is it is dangerous it's not good to do that i don't understand that people will drink and drive or drunk and will drive i just don't understand that it's not good it's not funny it's not cool it's dangerous not only you're putting yourself in danger, you're putting other people in danger. Like, come on, man. Yo was not slowing down and was going to crash head on into the officer's squad car. With other vehicles surrounding him, the officer had no escape route to avoid the collision. He activated his emergency lights and siren to warn others of the impending danger. Yo! Yo! Unfortunately, the officer's body cam was in the charging dock at the moment of impact, but was then quickly activated. He located his radio on the floorboard and notified dispatch of the accident. Meanwhile, his passenger struggled to open her door due to the collision and had difficulty breathing. Despite this, both of them managed to exit the squad car. The officer subsequently approached Sergio, who displayed a visible head injury. Additional units soon arrived as the main officer began to experience headaches. We'll talk to you in a little bit. Stay seated. Stay seated. Stay seated. Okay. Can we talk care. to witnesses? Oh, watch your big sheets. Let's make sure. Okay, we'll help with Dave. Hey, stay there, stay there. Hey, yo. Hey, stay there. Stay there. Don't move. Just sit back in your seat. Bro, stop it. As officers tried to get him to cooperate, they noticed his speech was slurred and his inability to stop using the word bro. One thing, this Sergio person, um, I just want to say you're stupid and you're just dumb. Not only you're driving under the influence, you're drinking, also you ran and got into a car crash with a police officer. So now, they, so now when you drink, you guys know when you guys drink, right, or whatever it is, you know, sometimes your speeches get slurred sometimes. So sometimes people know. So now the cops know that he was intoxic intoxicated, drinking, and know he's slurring his words. So now that they're going to help him, they're going to get locked up because he ran into a police officer. If you ran into a police officer, hit a police officer, this and that, fight a police officer like that, you're done. You're done because then you're going to add more and more charges and plus, they're probably going to give you reckless endangerment because not only you're putting yourself in danger, you're putting them in danger and you're putting other people in danger because you want to act dumb and drink and drive and think it's cool. Hey, Have a seat. Hey, hey, Have a seat. Have a seat. Copy. Bro, sit down. Stop it. Sit down. Hey, Starting today, anyone can monetize with... This is not cool. It's not funny. It's this is just stupid and, and and just watching it, it just gets irritating that people do this. Drink and drive for what? What do you get out of this? It's not cool. So, you know what? I checked in with your officer. Hey, sit down. I'm not even doing anything. Hey bro. Can you tell him to stop please? Have a seat. Have a seat. And then we'll talk. I was walking on Century and I was to that stoplight. It's probably for, that's probably oh, for sure. It's probably between alcohol and... Stay awake. Stay awake with us. Stay awake. Bro! No, no, 
no, no, just stay seated more. Stay seated, just man. stay awake. Okay. We're gonna have... Bro! We wanna have county. I was already there. Okay. You're already where? With you, bro. Oh, for, anyway, we're getting ready to check on the other car versus tree. I was already with you. And you were already with the Before I checked bro, the area, bro, I didn't see anything obvious. Near this is easy. stupid, dude. Didn't look super close, though. There is an ambulance. Bro, because you know that it, it, it wasn't even... That's it for ambulance. Bro. Oh, five, uh, oh, three, 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 See, now I'm happy and I'm glad that their police officers right here, they're handling this in a way, they're handling this in a way, like they're handling it in a good way, you know what I'm saying? They're not really yelling, yelling at him, they're not doing none of that. Obviously, he's going to jail, but obviously, they still got to make sure he's good. Now, they're probably waiting for the EMS to come, you know what I'm saying, to make sure the officer that got hit in the collision too is good and that's him. If you look by his fingers, you can tell that he's he has blood on his hands, this and that. And they just tell him to wake, to, uh, stay awake. I feel like when you get in a car crash like that, bad like that, and you head up in legend like that, you need to stay awake because you never know. If you fall asleep, you, you never know what could happen. You know what I'm saying? Um, but right now, I love how the police are, are taking this situation. They're doing good. And you're know, saying once they get him treated right, he's going to jail. <laughs> he's going to jail. Right here, stay, stay warm so we can have you get checked out. Bro, you're the only one that did this and on me out. What are you talking about? You hit your head. You're confused right now. Just stay seated. Stay seated. Wait. They got to cut me. Wait. I'm gonna put you in here because you don't stay seated. Deja de tocarme porque yo soy aquí. Mira, wey. So there's an accident down the street. Um, I will move my truck, but I need you to just pull into the parking lot yes, up here sir. on the right. I'll pull the parking lot goal. Because I don't want you to have to back up the trailer. Give me a second, though. Mira, güey. Tú me estuviste aquí y acá. I don't understand Spanish. Yeah. So here's what. The <laughs> no, 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 no. no. Uh, this cop is. This boy started speaking Spanish. He cop was like, I don't understand Spanish. Now you can tell he's trying to like. The dude that's intoxicated, speaking Spanish, and also he is confused because I feel like once you hit your head that hard, head up and listen, you're going to be confused. And also, you're not in the right state of mind to really realize what's going on and that you fucked up. He probably doesn't know that he fucked up. You know what I'm saying? But once he's done, once all this stuff wears off and it's done, he's going to realize that he fucked up and he's going to jail. Not only a car crash, but you also hit into a police officer. Like, come on now. Come down. No, no, no. Come down. No, no, no. <laughs> hey, bro. Hey, I'm going to move my car, but I need you to pull into the parking lot for pick and save. Turn around, and I'm shutting down the road here, okay? I think so, but he's also, he hit his head hard. And he's not. He's not. Bro. Hey. Hey. Relax. Hey, bro. Oh, three, what's your mark the driver detained for right now? Dude. All right, so I'm shutting down the road. That's why I stopped here in the middle, okay? I didn't understand because we go up and go around. I need you to either U-turn or go into the pick and save lot, okay? Okay, yeah, that light back there didn't seem to be working. Yeah. Um, so just do me a favor, don't go down to where all the lights are, okay? Get out of here before someone else it up. Yeah. Are you trying to turn? Hold on one second. Thanks, Mark. Terry, are we having the county come do this? Oh, dude! <laughs> I'm asking you, like, please, man. Dude, like, if you want me to tell you that, like, I respect you, dude. I want you to get checked out by the ambulance, what I want. I respect you to do that. So there is an accident down there. The yeah. road is shut down mm -hmm. for now. Um, Would you want me to try and go straight? Or? Yes. 
please. Okay. Do you want me to go now? Uh, when the light turns green, okay? Let me what the go. Fuck? What? Did she ask you want me to go now? No, no. What are you talking about? Duh. Wait till the light goes green. You want me to go now? What are you talking about? The light is red. Wait until it goes green. Does she really say that? You want me to go now? No. Yes, go. Yeah, yeah, go now. Go now. Yeah, go now. Yeah, go now. Yeah, go now. Do you have any weapons on you? Um... What if I told you that you can use motion... That's crazy, y'all. This is just... Mm. Come on, let's go. Jesus Christ. Do you not see the big f***ing arrow? Uh, do you not see the big arrow? He had his head. Oh, yeah. good here, so... What's your name? Spanish. Yeah, you got one left in there. So he said, give us He speaks English too. What's your name? Tell me what your name is. Sergio Vestas. Sergio, I'm Adam. I'm one of the paramedics. Are you hurt? Yes. Were you hurt? Go. Were you hurt? Hey, were you hurt? With this, I haven't done anything. Okay. Bro. Hey. We're gonna take you down the hospital. We're just gonna figure out what your injuries are for right now, okay? Have you been drinking today? You're not. You're not drinking? You're not. You're not what? You're not what? No. See y'all, but then also what's really sad is I feel like there's something going on with him, but he's drinking and doing this because he's trying to like, you know, saying, I don't know, it's just, yeah, I got what I'm saying, because for like with us humans sometimes or people, usually like there's something really going on or something's really wrong with us or they know something. People usually tend to either drink or get high or smoke, whatever it is, to take that pain away or get that mindset where they're not thinking about that. The thing is they're putting themselves in danger and the other people in the in the in the neighborhood in the, in the community. You know what I'm saying? So this is I don't know, man. No, stop, stop! What's your name? Sergio. Sergio, what happened? He already told me that he was trying to give me some. Yeah, so I'm giving me with like that. You want to just get a... So he hit head on going the wrong way? Is that what happened? Uh, yeah, man. my understanding. Like, yeah. No, man. Totally, like... Relax. You, you know what? Have you guys done breath or anything? No. no. No, we we're trying to we're trying to get him to stay in the car, car but Bruh. he just keeps getting on when he got up. Bruh. Have a seat here. Help me down here. Or, yeah. Turn. Yep. Have a seat. Do you not see the big f***ing arrow? Jesus Christ. What do you want us to do? Switch the cuffs to the front. You got it? You want me to do it? No, I got blood all over my hands. So. Yeah, so do I, but... I'll switch it. Hold on. Hold on. Stop. Oh, for one more, please, for, uh... Come on, bro. Go. 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 You. Go. See, See I'm hoping whoever the, the cop is that got into the accident, I hope he's good, too. I don't know if in the video if they showed us if the cop is okay. Um, I hope he's okay, you know what I'm saying? Because... You, you never know what could happen, bro. In, in this world, bro, this world is unpredictable. You know what I'm saying? We come into this world with a birth date, a date we come into this world, but we don't know when our expiration date is. You know what I'm saying? That can be anything. It can be, you can be driving, walking, like, it, it can be anything. So I hope the cop was okay. Uh, I don't know. They let me know. I don't know if they showed it, but I hope the cop is okay. You know what I'm saying? It's... It's because stuff like this, it's sad also because people can probably lose a lot of blood and lose their life. Maybe something can hit the brain where the brain hits a certain part of the brain where you lose your life. Many scenarios can happen in this and it's, it's just sad. It can probably get you irritated and mad to the point where you're asking why the person that was drinking and driving doing this, you know what I'm saying? Why did you not go? 
No, but you can't get, you'll have to go around to get to high road. You can't get there this way. There was a head-on crash. You can't get through. Hey, just, just stop moving, okay? Just relax. We're trying to help you. Bro, I was... Just relax. Yeah. Keep your feet I was up. standing yeah, here and like, 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 like... It's been a lot too. Bro, so put your out. legs up here. Hey, hey, you up here. Up. Do you not see me? Do you not see me? Do you not see me? Jesus Christ. Okay, now that that's on, that'll help okay. a little. Got me. I was just uh, gonna get some of the property for the jail, his ID and stuff. Can I get an ID? Yeah, it's in here. So I'll just pull it out. And this is what he has. Just an update: there will be some possible 55 issues with our driver. So if you want to let the county know that as well. Terry, I'm just gonna take. In county four, I'm gonna three, take eight, his nine. wallet. Okay. But I'm gonna leave everything else in his pocket on the chair. Okay. I don't know if county wants okay. that, but we'll Good. take this with. Is stuff in the side doors yours or no? The gloves and the hat, okay. yeah. Everything in the back. So okay. So okay. You got your body cam, we'll hang out of that. Just throw it in the back. Okay, got it, buddy. So, we're sitting in the chief's car right now. We're just kind of waiting for another ambulance to get here, so. But we're okay. Your beard is a good position. Why don't you take that's some vehicles up? Pete, that's good. Well, 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 that was. I'm glad they're okay because stuff like this, you just never know what could happen. They could be still fighting for their life, like probably two days, three days, and the next day they tell you, unfortunately, uh, we couldn't help him. He, you know what I'm saying? This is this stuff like this. I just don't like. Like I just do not like this. I do not like it because I just don't like it. Oh, okay. Okay, no, so that's fine if you... That way we don't act out move your vehicle. We want to keep it there. Working with other... Uh, like, do you get what I'm pretty much trying to say? Like, yeah, uh, man. So, the airbags went off. We saw it coming. And, uh, save me. Here, say hi to save me. <laughs> hey, Brian. Yeah, they're mine, but they fell into blood and everything else, so they're junk now. I didn't know the wind was going to blow them off. 4389, just advising there's possible 1055 issues. So we let him hit us head on, because if he would have turned, it would have hit the side of the car, you know? But we don't know what's going on with this dude. I'll keep you posted. I just want to let you know that we're okay. That's good. That's good. I'm glad they're okay. That's good. Unreal. I just will keep picturing that in my head and it's like, this isn't happening, you know? I thought I must be a jinx. No, you're not a jinx. This guy's 55. So, I mean, it's all, all, all on him. Hey. He's going to shoot through this intersection and probably have a collision if it wouldn't have been you. So, I'd rather have it be hey, this squad controlled by... You're going to be fine. I'm just glad you guys are just a little... You know, some bruises. So, we'll get the ambulance going to be here in a second. I'll shut right. this door. Okay. Oh, my God. The smoke inside the car is what got me. Oh, I and know And I it. couldn't get out because of the airbag. I saw you cut it. I had to grab my knife <laughs> and cut it to deflate it just so I could get out yeah. and then... I couldn't get the door open far enough. I know. Well, that's why I was just like, unbuckle yourself, like, let's play it play by play and not, yeah. not panic because I was, that smoke that was coming in. It's hard to breathe, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, I was like, oh my god, I was like, if this starts on fire, like, that is not how I'm going to go out. I'm sorry this happened. No, no, it's it's not. Do you know, did all the airbags pop? Do you know what popped exactly? No, no, they they all, pop. all, all four, four side curtains, everything, no. back seat, no. everything. No. How are you? Yeah. Do you need something, man? Dude, my head hurts, my chest hurts. I yeah. need to go to the EMS. Let's get you down the hospital, too. To yeah, he, need, he needs treatment. If he said his head hurts and his chest, he needs to get he needs to get that checked out because you, you just never know what could happen. You can get hit, and you think you're, you're okay, in the sun part of the head or brain that, you know what I'm saying? At 30, 35 miles per hour and hit us head on. So I was trying to maneuver, but if I would have maneuvered to the left, but then that would have hit her side door. And so then I just decided to take it head on and leave it at that. The tire and that brush guard saved a lot of other things from coming into the inning as well. It's coming a lot worse, brother. Yeah, man. Sergio was then transported to the hospital to be treated for his injuries, where he remained uncooperative and had to be restrained by his ankles and wrists to the hospital bed.
It was also discovered he had one prior OWI offense. Both the wow. officer and his ride-along passenger sustained significant injuries from the crash, resulting in both of them missing work for an extended period. Sergio was charged with felony counts of OWI causing injury, prohibited alcohol content causing injury, Thank misdemeanor you. counts of yes. OWI, second yes. offense, operating with prohibited alcohol content, second offense, and operating while revoked. Thank he you. also received several traffic citations totaling nearly $1,000 and was Thank subsequently you. given a $500 signature bond. Yes. As of November 2023, he was found guilty of OWI causing injury. The remaining charges were dismissed, but read in. Ultimately, he was sentenced to five years in the Dane County Jail. Yes. 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 Let's go. Visit CodeBlueCam.com and treat video. your family. Friend. That was a great video. Let me know what y'all think down below, man. Comment down below what y'all want to see next. We out.